Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here. Coming at you with a mail day for Saturday. I've got uh, five possible TTMs here to uh, open live, and then I have one success from yesterday and one failure. Um, it's for the Junk Wax Challenge. Uh, I pulled uh, Cal Ripken Jr., and I uh, figured I'd give it a shot. Uh, I didn't send a donation or anything. I just thought, hey, Maybe I'll get lucky or something, but uh, yeah, it was returned unsigned with no note or anything. Uh, but uh, I guess the address at least works. So they, they, if you send a donation, you might actually get them. So that was kind of a bummer, but uh, kind of expected. But thought I'd give it a shot just for the challenge. Then the success is three photos signed by former Patriots linebacker Mike Vrabel and uh, coach for the Titans. And that's where I sent to is the Tennessee Titans. One, two, and a five by seven. So one of those is going to go in the bruise. And then the five we got in. So even got one from September 2017. I don't know what's uh, this month. There's been quite a few, uh, at least three or four that have come back that I said in September 2017 they're coming back this month for some reason so I don't know what's going on there but hey happy they get them back so uh, Orlando Florida was sent in March it's pretty thick okay it's just three photos felt like there's more I've um, got Steve Mix from the Philadelphia 76ers, signed three photos. This one he signed for Bruce, so very cool. It'll be going to him. And he got his package the other day and he was very happy with it. And he's already uploaded a few pics on his uh, Facebook page. And this one's a 5 by 7 And he's all the way over there on close for the Duke there on that right side. So very cool return there. Steve Mix. Next up, Santa Ana, California. This was sent also in March. Um, it is John David Booty. Uh, pretty good college quarterback. Played for several NFL teams. Here's uh, the championship game. USC versus UCLA, I believe. Yeah, that's the Trojans. So, very cool. So, two 5x7s signed by John David Booty. Very cool. And then uh, North Texas, Dallas, Texas had to handwrite these. Uh, I'm going to have to order some more labels. Mr. Kyle Clifton, who was a very good linebacker for the Jets for a number of seasons, He's a very good tackler. Um, he made my cut for uh, my NFL Stars binder. Some people may not put them in there, but uh, when I get enough cards to fill up those binders, I'll do a video and do a little bit of explaining if I can, how I came to conclude how I chose everybody. So yeah, that's pretty cool, Kyle Clifton. Next up is Fort Myers, Florida. So sent also March 2019. Says, I put a few extra cards in here for you. So that's nice. I wonder who this is. Try and show the photos first. And on the note, it says, Caleb, thanks for writing to me. Good luck with your collection. Lee. It's very cool. So I included two photos one for me and one for Bruce. 
of Mr. Lee Norwood from the Detroit Red Rings. Played back in the 80s and 90s. Uh, he's a really nice person to send to if you're ever looking to send to some hockey players. And looks like he included a couple extra cards, which is really cool. So this one's with the St. Louis Blues. A little bit later in his career. And then this is a card of the photo he signed. 1989-90 tops. So that's really cool. Thank you so much, Mr. Norwood, for doing that. Uh, that's pretty awesome. Uh, always love it when people uh, go above what you would expect and send you some extra stuff. So I'll make sure uh, one of those gets to Bruce. So thank you so much. And finally, we have one from Cleveland, Ohio. This is the one from September 2017. You kind of see through it. Looks like a football. Okay, I know who, who this is. I sent to the Oakland Raiders when they were still in Oakland, obviously. A 5x7 of their backup. Connor Cook, I don't know if he's still their backup or not anymore. But uh, hey, nice to get this back. Um, kind of thought that was lost forever, so got him his Michigan State uniform, so very cool. He's still, you know, fairly young. Who knows, maybe he'll get a chance and uh, see what uh, he can do maybe in the future. So all in all, not too bad there. Um, again, I will be away and won't be able to do a video to uh, probably do a little recap probably on next Sunday. Or Monday it depends on when I get back so uh, no videos for a while but uh, hopefully you guys had another good mail day and hope you have a good weekend and I'll see you next week talk to you later